welcome back to my channel if you're new here then hi hello welcome come on in today we have a shaky little b m haul who is excited i'm very excited i went a few days ago in these bags are dropping and these bags have just been sat in my room so i need to seriously hurry up and haul them and um, we've already broken to one item because you know we needed it but i'm going to keep this intro short let us just dig on in to our b&m haul so first things first just please excuse any mess this room is getting a declutter this week um i'm just waiting to take all the christmas decorations down and then just to have a canvas just to sort out so please excuse that so first off like i said we've already cracked into oh my gosh it's all fallen we've already cracked into this but i thought i'd show you anyway kitchen roll because i either buy kitchen roll or toilet roll sometimes both but this time it was kitchen roll we use so much kitchen roll it's a joke like when i got this we ran out and we've already gone through a whole thing already um i love to use kitchen roll to clean the mirrors with i know it's not the most equal friendly of ways but i find that like it cleans glass and mirrors the absolute best like way better than anything else so yeah, and then like any spillages and X, Y, Z. But let us crack on in to the fun stuff. Now, this might be excessive, right? But last year, I fell in love with this. And because it's a Christmas special scent, it was basically non-existent. So I have, yes, I have six of these. I've stuck bought and I've already got one um, in the cupboard that I haven't used yet. And there's a very high chance I'm going to buy six more so that I've got one every month until it comes back. But this is the gingerbread cookie scent reed diffuser and it is just beautiful. It's a nice clear liquid and then the bottle cap is a bit bronzy gold. Um, it kind of basically goes with everything in our aesthetic but it just smells so good. I already have the wax melts of these as well. I repurchased those um, at the beginning of the season last year, like November, October time, um, just to stock up because the scent is just so, smells so good. So I did buy six of them and I have absolutely no regrets. They are three pound each. So you do the math because I'm not gonna tell Tom that that's what I do. That's where, that's where all our money's gone. Um, something a tiny bit boring as well, bleach. I feel like we've run out of bleach in one of the bathrooms. Um, so I just thought I'd get some while I was there, just to remember. So bleach is always super handy to have. I usually don't really, I very rarely clean with bleach. I use other products, but I feel like bleach is just something you kind of need to have, don't you? So you never know where you might need it. I grabbed Tom a Nivea Caring Shower Cream. This is the coconut and jojoba one. I absolutely adore coconut. If you've been here before, if you've watched any of my hauls before, you know that the majority of our shower scented things are coconut. I just love the smell of coconuts. I'm one of those people. I also love bounties. Those are my favorite chocolates. And I love that no one else does so that when I put my hand into a box of celebrations, I'm gonna be okay. Oh, it just smells so nice. And jojoba oil, I love the smell of as well. And then the last thing in this bag was a Harpic Active Fresh Mountain Pine scent. Um, I haven't actually smelled this, but it's just kind of like what you clean the toilets with. So, oh, oh, it smells cute. It smells nice. Just like cleaning products, really. It just smells like clean. So yeah, um, I just got this for the toilets again. I think we were running out and I just want to do new year deep clean we're decluttering loads of stuff i've decluttered my bathrooms that was my last vlog which i will leave link down below just a little plug there for myself um i'm doing one in this room the living room the kitchen the kitchen's kind of had a declutter already but i need to do a deep clean and clean clean the oven damn oven i hate cleaning the oven i don't know about anyone else a couple of fun bits that i got we haven't had new ones of these i don't think ever since like the first one the one that we have is just the first one that we ever brought um, this is just a kitchen roll holder. It was four pounds. Yeah, four pounds. And it's wood and then black. Um, and I just thought it was a bit more sleeker. The one that we currently have is just like a chrome one. Which, once you pop the um, kitchen roll on, you can't really see it anyway. But I just thought it's a bit more, a bit nicer. Like, we're we're growing up in our house. We're growing up a bit. So, you know, new, uh, new appliancey things. It's not really an appliance, is it? And then this is a fruit basket, which is as well as four pounds. It's the same aesthetic, the black and the wood. But I feel like for this, you could put anything in there. You could put like dishwasher tabs, you could put bath bombs, you could put like washing machine tabs, like you could bread, anything you want, but we're gonna use it for a fruit bowl, I reckon. Cause again, our current one is a um, chrome one as well. Like I said, when we got them, like it was just whatever was in 
I think like TK Maxx, I want to say. Sorry, the bleach has fallen. And even though the cap's open and it's never been open, I got a bit scared. Um, yeah, we just got it from like TK Maxx or wherever. So it was just like a basic chrome, just get it. And like I said, you can't really see it anyway, but I thought that now we're growing up a little bit more, getting married soon and all that, that we'll have a few, a few new nicer pieces. This is like a really fun one, I think, because there's like food in here. So... I picked up some Pringles. I absolutely adore this flavour. It's sour cream and onion. It's the best flavour. That one and the Texas barbecue I will allow people to like. If you like any other flavour, we've got problems. I feel like the red salt is too salty. Like, I get so dehydrated. And if you're a salt and vinegar fan of any form of crisp, we are not friends. I can't... Who likes salt and vinegar? No, it cuts my mouth. I'm not a fan. I picked up these for Tom as a little surprise. We picked them up before and he really, really liked them. They are just kinder... Uh, like little snowmen and ladies. He was a bit disappointed because I thought uh, he think he thought that they were for the tree, um, but they didn't have any little like what's that word called thread on them. It's just like little chocolates to have. But I bit them up anyway because I saw them and I thought of him. Um, picked up two packs of dental floss. Like I said, we have two bathrooms, so one in each bathroom, um, and it's just a mint flavour. If anyone kind of really cares. Tom likes floss quite a bit. Let's just do this because this one is super boring because it's just medicine. We've got two packets of ibuprofen. If you watched my uh, bathroom declutter that, that vlog, we have so much ibuprofen. We do not have a single pack of paracetamol, but Tom was adamant that we needed ibuprofen, so we got that. But we actually do need paracetamol, so I'm going to go and get that. Um, I picked up some backups of the, oh, this is like a different, is this a different one? The Dishmatic Heads, but this one says Heavy Duty and it looks a lot thicker. Um, like the scrowl a bit. Oh, I don't know if this is the normal one. Oh, maybe I've made a boo-boo there. Mm, we'll see. But basically, um, we just needed some backups. But I need to check if they're the same ones. I don't feel like they are. For pots, pans and tougher washing up. Mm. Well, oh well, we can keep it. See what happens. Picked up a Dishmatic Scrubby, one of these, because R1 is completely like ruined, like the, the threads and things are pouring out. I actually cut myself on this once. So like, there was like a wire that popped out and like I picked it up and like went to like pop it out and it slipped my finger open. Um, these are not to be played with. These are not toys. Keep out of reach of children. I feel like it should say that. And it should come with a, um, a warning that you can harm yourself. You can cause bodily harm. Yes, you can. Um, a kind of boring one as well. Razors. I like these kind of razors. I find that they cut the most. I find that men's razors cut the absolute most. But I don't really like the ones that have like the soap either side or the Venus ones or like the branded ones. I feel like they don't shave as well. These like cheeky ones, I feel like shave very, very, very well. I do very rarely um, cut myself, but I will say I've actually swapped to waxing. That's just kind of for the places I don't get waxed. So, but I don't really cut myself anyway. I know people have a thing with that. Oh, I picked up another one of these. I must have picked it up as a backup because I have enough in my shower. But I really want to get into just like, not hoarding and not like buying so that no one else has any stock left. But I want to get into just having enough on ro rotation and enough things to back up. So if, for God forbid, we run out of a shower gel mid-shower, we have the backup so i really want to get into just making sure i have enough um i picked up these silicone utensils because i needed this i just needed one and bnm did not have one why do you not just have this i don't need those and now i have excess i just needed a baster is that what they are i'm pretty sure um but yeah but they were three pounds so i couldn't complain i guess even though i just did <laughs> Right, last couple of bits are both scenty things. I picked up some Lenore Unstoppables Incense Wash Boosters, and this is Vanilla Sparkle. Vanilla vanilla and coconut are like my favorite scents. I'm very bland when it comes to that. I just like things that are easy and like uh, multi-purpose like scents. Like I can, list, I can like it in January, I can like it in July, and I can like it in September, do you know what I mean? And this just smells so nice. I don't use incense boosters in every wash. I usually use them in bedding towels and if like i don't know why would i ever use them in gloves sometimes i use them in gloves like jumpers like thicker things but usually i don't usually use them in every wash just like things that are really stick for example towels and beddings you like to sleep in that and 
dry yourself. And then the final thing is a Zaflora. This is the Fur Needle and Amber. I don't love the new packaging. I feel like everyone said that. I really don't love the new packaging. I find it just looks so bland and I don't really like, I don't really care for it. Um, but yeah, I picked up this. I haven't had this scent before. And my favorite one around this time of year is Cranberry and Orange, I wanna say it is. I love mandarin and lime as well, but not for this time of year. But this one just smells quite Christmassy. It has like a bit of a mintness to it. Maybe that's the pine. Um, but yeah, I picked him up. And he's okay out of the box. So that I'll just keep him out of the box anyway. But let me move that out of the way. That's just, you're propped up on uh, on some boxes. So, <laughs> naughty me. So I hope you guys enjoyed my little B&M haul. Like I said, it was quite little quite you know just to the point everything i needed um i'm not going too crazy yet i feel like every time i go in there i can go crazy but i'm not going too crazy yet we're going to do loads of declutters in the house um and just figure out what i want to do with the aesthetic and anything else that we want to buy um and kind of just have a place for everything and then i'll purchase new things along the way but this was just basically a run in grab some backups but also some new bits as well so if you guys enjoyed this if you did then please give it a thumbs up don't forget to comment share and subscribe to my channel because it helps me out so much and i have a lot of goals in 2022 that i want to reach so you guys can help me and i'll help you and you know so yeah thank you so much and i will see you in my next one bye we can watch some tv watch some netflix if you want you you can come on over if you want to